friends today we will talk about addition addition means putting the things together the result obtained after addition is called the sum let us learn addition of four digit numbers without regrouping addition of four digit numbers without regrouping add 2324 and 3452 First arrange numbers in the column form then by adding digits at ones place we get 4 plus 2 is equal to 6 adding digits at tens place we get 2 plus 5 is equal to 7 adding digits at hundreds place we get 3 plus 4 is equal to 7 adding digits at thousands place we get 2 plus 3 is equal to 5 so 2324 plus 3452 is equal to 5776 before learning addition with regrouping let us understand the meaning of regrouping by an example let us add 70 cherries and 50 cherries we can write 70 and 50 as 7 tens and 5 tens 7 tens plus 5 tens is equal to 12 tens 12 tens is equal to 102 tens let us add 272 and 859 firstly arrange 272 and 859 in columns then add digits at ones place and regroup that is 2 plus 9 is equal to 11 ones or 11 ones is equal to 1 tens plus 1 ones now add digits at tens place and regroup that is 1 plus 7 plus 5 is equal to 13 or 13 tens is equal to 100s plus Three tens. Again, add digits at hundreds place and regroup. That is, one plus two plus eight is equal to eleven. Eleven hundreds is equal to one thousands plus one hundreds. Therefore, two hundred seventy-two plus eight hundred fifty-nine is equal to one thousand one hundred thirty-one. word problems on addition friends the concept of addition are used in many daily life activities let us consider two examples example 1 a fruit seller sold 165 boxes of apples 326 boxes of oranges and 89 boxes of grapes in a week how many boxes of fruits did he sell altogether solution here we shall add boxes of all types of fruits sold first we will arrange the numbers in columns and then add do not forget to regroup so the total number of boxes sold are 580 example 2 in a school library there were 2317 books the school bought 3000 170 books more how many books are there now here we will add old and new books arrange the numbers in columns and then add so the total number of books in the school library is 